Hey guys, as you know, to use ChatGPT4, the current best AI language model, ChatGPT Plus costs around $20 a month. So in this video, I'll show you two alternatives I found that allow you to use ChatGPT4 for free. Obviously, some things can't be replicated like the GPT store, but surprisingly, most of the features can be used for free in these two resources. So diving right in, the first one is Poe.com. And Poe has many different chatbots. Um, it's a large ecosystem from Quora. And here you can find Llama, Mistral, Claude, etc. You can even chat with specialized bots like those found in GPT Store for chemistry or physics. And as you can see, you can also chat with ChatGPT4. So Poe's ChatGPT4 does have a limit and it can only provide text. So unlike ChatGPT Plus subscription, you cannot access images via Dolly E3. Furthermore, there is a limited usage requirement for the free plan. The second option and my personal favorite alternative is copilot.microsoft.com, a service from Microsoft that uses GPT-4. For a first example, I'll try generating the image. So we can say generate and image of a dog and meanwhile that runs in the background um, so it uses the DALA E3 plugin and while that runs in the background another interesting about Copilot is that you can use GPT-4 in your Microsoft 365 apps like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook and Teams so, so this has great integration with Microsoft's uh, products and for this, um, all you need is an internet connection and a free Microsoft account to use it. But you can use it for free if you are a Microsoft 365 user. Um, and the main benefit of this Copilot chat is that you can also generate images, unlike Poe. And furthermore, its image generator is powered by Dolly E3 as seen here. And one thing Copilot can do that ChatGPT actually can't do right now is generate music. So as you can see here, Copilot um, has integration with another plugin called Suno, and it can generate uh, music using the Suno plugin. And this actually takes a bit, so I'll let that run in the background. Another reason why I love Copilot is because its limit is way higher than Poe for the requests. With Copilot chat, essentially you can have a very high number of requests, but each conversation is limited to 30 messages. So if you do pass 30 messages, then you can always start another conversation. Furthermore, Copilot is based off Bing, which has access to real-time data. So unlike ChatGPT, you can access real-time news, information, etc. because ChatGPT is, does have a historical training cutoff. And so it looks like the audio has been generated and it seems to be linked to the Suno website. So unfortunately, it does take a while. So these are the two free ways to use ChatGPT4, Poe.com and Copilot.Microsoft.com. Uh, I will make sure to link these two below in a pinned comment. And they both use ChatGPT4, but each of them do that have their pros and cons. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, and if you ha do have any alternatives you prefer, make sure to comment below. As always, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.